Hello everyone. In this lecture, we will discuss how to save a circuit or a selected portion of a circuit to an icon menu. For that, first let me open one drawing from the CAD SIM project. I will go to the circuit practice drawing that we have created in the earlier lecture. Now this is the circuit available over here in this drawing. I would like to save this circuit into the icon menu. For that you need to go to this schematic tab and then in the edit components panel you go to this circuit drop down and choose this save circuit to icon menu tool. On choosing this tool you can see the save circuit to icon menu dialog box is displayed. This dialog box is similar to the insert component dialog box. Only thing is that this add drop down list is added over here. If I click on the arrow of this drop down list you can see number of options are there. These options are used to add a component, command, new circuit or add any existing circuit or add a sub menu to the icon menu. So you can use the options accordingly. Now as I have to save the circuit to icon menu I need to choose this new circuit option. On choosing this option you can see the create new circuit dialog box is displayed. Here in this icon details area you can see the name edit box is there. In this edit box you need to enter the name for the circuit. Suppose I enter circuit 1. Next below this the image file edit box is there. This edit box is used to specify the image file to be used for the new icon means the image for the icon that will be created over here you need to specify the image file over here like you can see for the user circuit 24 this image is there for user circuit 23 you can see this image is there in the similar way for this new circuit to be saved in icon menu file you need to specify the image for that circuit so you can specify the full location over here or you can choose the browse button to go to the image file using this select image file dialog box or you can choose the pick button and on choosing the pick button you can see you can pick the block you can see here the select block is displayed in the command prompt only thing is that in that case you need to have the block created before you select the image file right now in our case block is not created so let us press escape over here and again you are returned to this create new circuit dialog box and now I can even choose the active button on choosing the active button you can see the whole circuit practice drawing image is displayed over here and the name of the image file is also displayed in this image file edit box but here you can see the title block for this drawing is also displayed here so I will now first temporarily choose cancel from this dialog box and also choose cancel from this dialog box and I will remove suppose title block and now again I will choose this save circuit to icon menu tool I will choose this add drop down I will choose this new circuit option and here I will just write again circuit 1 and for image file now if I choose the active button you can see only the circuit is displayed as a preview in this preview window and also you can see the create png from current screen image checkbox is selected and here the path for this png file is displayed over here next let us go to the circuit drawing file area here you need to specify the file name for of the new circuit suppose I make it custom circuit 1 let us skip it and you can see on writing the name in this edit box the location for this custom circuit 1 drawing file is displayed below it next I will choose the ok button now you can see in the command prompt you are prompted to specify the base point suppose I specify the base point this one Next, I need to specify the objects that are to be included in the circuit. 
that is to be saved in the icon menu suppose i specify this complete circuit like this now i will press enter and on doing so you can see the circuit one icon is displayed actually i have not written the name of the icon correctly by mistake c was not pressed one more thing i can do to change the name of this icon i can just select this i can right click and choose properties and here i can change the name of the icon to circuit 1 and choose the ok button so this is how you can even correct the name of the circuit that is saved in this icon menu and now you can use this saved circuit in any other drawings for your future use so that is all in this lecture in the next lecture we will discuss how to copy the circuit so thank you guys Thank you.